and welcome to Cloud Tech Talks. My name is Pritesh and I'm back with another video. This video is about top 5 security features of Dropbox business. So let's get started. Number 1. Sharing controls and permissions. It's very important for any administrator or data owner of an organization to make sure that the company sensitive information does not fall in the wrong hands. This is precisely what granular sharing controls and permissions offered by Dropbox ensures. Something as simple as password protecting a file when you share it with someone within the organization. Something as simple as setting an expiration date to the content that you share. Imagine if I set an expiry for one week from now, on the eighth day you will not be able to access that uh, information. How useful is that in terms of sharing and granular controls? Most importantly, many administrators and file owners want to make sure that the data does not be leaked outside the company and hence Dropbox even allows to put restrictions on sharing outside the organization. So this was the first feature I wanted to talk about. The second most important feature is lost device protection. If someone loses a mobile phone on a tablet, we all know the same devices carry all the information from the company. As an administrator for Dropbox, you can actually remote wipe all of the information for that specific device and delink his account from that specific device completely. So even if it's falling in the wrong hands, no one will ever be able to access the information that existed on that mobile phone or tablet. It's a very useful feature and this should be one of the most important features in terms of security for administrators using Dropbox business. Feature number three, user authentication. Dropbox business enables an administrator of an organization to add additional layers of security when it comes to logging in. Something as simple as implementing a two-factor authentication where you receive a six-digit password or a code to be, to, en to be entered when you log in from an unknown device, etc. It's very useful because we use it all the time in, in, in terms of financial transactions, etc. No reason why it should not be used in a business environment as well. So that's the first point. The second point is it Dropbox business integrates with any leading single sign-on solution in the market. So if a company has implemented an Active Directory method, it is very easy for you to link an Active Directory for, with Dropbox business to ensure that the users get a single sign-on experience and add that additional layer of security to your business. Feature number four, transfer of accounts. For anyone who leaves an organization, it is very cumbersome for a successor of that specific person or even if he's not a successor but the data of that individual needs to be accessed. People use it, people typically capture this on a hard drive or a file server or a backup system and then they make it available uh, you know, in a legacy way. Dropbox allows with a click of a button transfer of all the information of someone who has left or a suspended or a deleted user to a user who is active in the system. This way you don't lose any information and it is very easy for you to go back and retain exactly what you need to find. Feature number five. This I believe is the most important feature and most of the users don't even understand that they can actually make use of Dropbox business for such a thing. It's called protection against malware or ransomware attacks. Now I'm not saying that it can actually stop a ransomware attack, it can actually stop a malware attack. That's uh, up to an organization's security policies and how stringent or how lenient they are. But let's say a user is actually affected by a malware attack. What happens in that attack? A uh, third party gets access to that information through, uh, through the file system that they're using and as a result they can either encrypt the information or they can steal the information and you will not have another way of recovering that information provided you do exactly what the ransomware attacker asks you to do. In this case, if you're using Dropbox business, all that you can do is with a click of a button roll back to the last known version of your files and folders 
effectively undoing everything that the attacker tried to do on your information. So if he tried to encrypt your data, if you roll back to the previous version, it will actually decrypt everything again and as a result, let you access the information in the last known usable way. This way, no user in the company will be under threat in terms of being attacked by someone or being worried about losing that information as a result of such an attack. So these were the top five security features of Dropbox business. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Like, share and subscribe to this channel if you want to see more of such videos. Till the next time, this is Pradesh signing off from Cloud Tech Talks. Have a nice day. Bye.